Well, Tonic's just um, launched the UK's first LGBT affirming retirement community. Um, it's a really important moment um, that um, prior to that we've had a, no specific provision um, anywhere in the UK for older LGBT people. Um, and what does that mean? Um, it means actually people have finally got a place where they can um, choose to move to. So um, some of our first um, residents are actually moving out of um, large family homes that they've been living on their own from really, you know, and not managing very well um, in that circumstance into Bank House because they're actually moving in with us as their LGBT family, a place where they can feel safe and supported um, and they haven't felt they've had that opportunity um, in just a regular scheme. And if you could give one tip to some housing providers who may want to do something similar, what would be your one big tip? Well, there's multiple ways of doing this. I mean, we've actually worked in partnership with One Housing, um, looking at actually an existing scheme where there were unsold shared ownership properties. Um, and so we're actually um, bringing empty properties back into use. We're bringing um, a new offer to the residents in that scheme. Um, but I think the really important tip there is actually work with LGBT organisations. Um, this is more complex than just putting a rainbow flag on the door and saying, you know, we support LGBT people. There's a, there's a lot of complexities there about understanding people's lives and experiences and supporting them. So it's very much working with the LGBT sector is really important.